Hi everyone, Federico's here. Today we're gonna take a look to the song Burning Water from the same album. This one is one of my favorite songs with I Wish You Were Mine, which you can find on the channel. I made the lesson a few times ago. But as always, before to go on, I suggest you to subscribe to the channel. And as always, I remember you that my English is very, very, very dangerous. So let's go. The song is in the key of F sharp minor. The song starts with this chord, the simple F sharp power chord at the ninth fret. Um, for the riff, you have to alternate your third finger. So the, the result is, is uh, that you switch from this, the F sharp, to this. You have to bar with your index finger these three strings. Here you have the notes F sharp, B, and E. And the middle, uh, your pinky is on the F sharp. So you switch from F sharp to C natural, sorry, uh, B natural. So, the whole riff. The next phrase is based on the fourth intervals. You have to play the two bottom strings at the 10th fret and at the 8th fret. So, this is a G power chord and this is an F power chord. The whole riff is played like this. section of the song is the B where you have to switch to A. During this part the guitar in the record plays this. This 
are the, the same chords, you can play the F here and the G here. Otherwise, you can play the F here and the G here. It's the same thing. The riff is played on these notes. C sharp, A, C sharp, D, E. And then you repeat the whole sequence. The second time you have to land on the G. Every time the phrase is closed, you have to put the F and the G also when you're in the A part. So these are the main two sections. The, the song is not so difficult to, to play or to uh, understand. Um, for the solo part, you, I suggest you to use a sort of false distortion. And um, which scale to use? You can use uh, simple pentatonics, F sharp minor during the F, F sharp uh, part. And uh, you can continue to use the, um, the same pentatonic uh, on the rest of the of the song but i suggest you to use it as michael plays during the, the a part the a mixolydian scale so to create a nice contrast between the, the two sections you can also play in a the, the simple um, E minor pentatonic because in the E minor pentatonic you can find the G, the E, the D, the B and the A um, which are notes that are included in the in the A mixolydian scale. So nothing too difficult in this one, but it's very fun to play, maybe for his simplicity. Hope you enjoy the lesson. See you next time, guys. Have a nice day. Remember, subscribe if you want more Landau's lesson. See you next video. Thanks for watching. Ciao.